Meanwhile, poor roads in the Takwa and Soye municipality are hampering access to health care. Residents want governments to ensure the roads are tarred. The Takwa and Soye municipality is one of the busiest commercial places in the western region due to mining activities. The population of the municipality, according to the 2010 Population and Housing Census, stands at 90,477 with 46,662 males and 43,815 females. Commuting and access to primary health care is done with much difficulty as most routes are in deplorable state. The highway that connects Takwade, Takwa, Bogoso through to Pristia has been left in this state for years. Referrals to the Fiamquanta government hospital in the regional capital are always not easy. There's no functioning ambulance in Takwa, so patients on referral conveyed in commercial vehicles are at the mercy of dust from the poor roads. Motorists are equally left at the mercy of the dust. The road is bad, and so we were happy when we heard the news that it would be fixed. However, nothing has been done. We are striving to endure the dust. Areas badly affected include Banchim, Ahuichieso, and Tamso. It is 3 p.m. Friday afternoon, but vehicles already have their headlights on. Pedestrians and residents have to rely on nose masks to protect themselves. The nose mask is what is saving us from dark inhalation. We spend the little money we have on nose masks for our families. Companies overwhelmed by the intensity of the dust deploy tankers to water the road. In 2017, the road was awarded to a contractor for emergency repairs, but not much has been done. The Sabia construction firm which secured the contract has not been able to deliver after constructing culverts. Regarded farms have not been released by the central government. 23rd March 2018, the contract was awarded, even though the contractor was there doing emergency work. By this time, uh, with a contract to do the job, but lack of funds. But residents want the contractor changed. The contract was not awarded to someone who can fix the road. The road is a busy one, so we need a contractor who can deliver. For commercial drivers, the state of the road takes a toll on their finances. We spend a little process we earn fixing our cars every three days, after which we are left with no money to cater for the home. This is really affecting us. Municipal Chief Executive for Tapa Nisoyem Gilbert Kenneth Asma blames the constant deterioration of rules on activities of some mining companies in the area. The gold, is, it doesn't affect it very much because gold, they don't send it all to the ports. But this one, they, they hold the all to the port and look at the, 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 the size of the trucks and their buckets and everything. I mean, that is not helping the road. He assured efforts are being made to get the road fixed. Hopefully roads in the municipality will be fixed soon. And as that for mission, mission is brought to you by Star Ghana with funding from Danida, UK Aid and the EU. Thanks so much for watching. Thank <laughs> you.